DJI Mavic Mini Orbit Time. Let's see what the app can do. And if not, don't worry. I'll show you how to manually orbit. Let's do this. First thing you want to do is fly up to what you want to orbit. In this case, it's this little thing right here. I want to orbit this. Nice, neat, here we go. I'll go down a little lower. I don't want to orbit too high. I prefer to stay low. All right, this looks good. This will make a nice orbit. I put my cross on it, my T, I'm lined up. Everything looks like it's good to go, but here's what you need to do first before you initiate anything. Take a look around and see if there's anything you can hit. Now, that this is the parachute jump, that red thing that's sticking up, but that's, that's way out there. That's very far. If I look all the way around the roller coaster, that's really low. That's below me. That's below me. I don't have any problems. I'm looking around, look around these buildings. Yes, I could probably hit them, but they're really far away and I'm definitely not going to be orbiting that far signal breaking up as you know uh, Mavic Mini's Wi-Fi as a matter of fact I have these parabolics but this might be the time to throw these parabolics on and get a better reception or worse reception all right so I'm looking around and I see that you know probably this where my cross is in the middle I could hit that if I wander off too far but I want to stay this is the max distance and I want to orbit this thing right here so I should be fine so now that I know I can't really hit anything I just click at the top right where it says full HD click on that I go to my quick shots at the bottom here BAM quick shots um, minimize this um, I'm going to circle I want to make a circle so I want to make a left circle first circle that's going to the left so that's about it i mean um i've lined up i've checked i can't hit anything while i'm orbiting let's put it on over there there we go we seem to have a lock on it let's hit start three two one go there we go it's going nice and smooth nice and smooth nice and smooth nice and smooth come on baby you can do this one percent one percent oh my gosh it's locking on it's locking on, it's going wide. Uh, the drone's drifting a little wide. I'm not too comfortable with that, but it's not too, too wide. That's not bad. I'll live with that, I'll live with that. It looks like it's dropping altitude a little bit. It's whirring around, it's swerving, it's going, it's going, it's holding, but it's, 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 it's not a perfect circle. And there we go, we lost it, we lost it. Now I hit this little pause button here, this same home button, you just tap it and that pauses the drone so that you don't have to worry about the drone wandering off. The Mini somehow is struggling with this so we'll have to orbit manually. Now to manually orbit, it's very simple. Watch my sticks, right, and my screen. I go up to what I want to orbit, of course, and I like to orbit close up. I don't know why. I check your return to home height and make sure my return home height is 390 feet. So in case I lose, uh, in case I lose signal while orbiting behind it, I know it will go up higher because it's this thing is obviously 127 feet. So as long as I go about 130, 40 feet up, I should be fine. So I'm gonna set my return to home altitude at about two. 230 250 uh, somewhere around there i know i will clear all obstacles around me safety first guys now that we've done that we can start orbiting now it's very simple if i'm going to orbit to the right i must push the stick to the right if i push the stick to the left it's veering to the left if i push the stick to the right it's veering to the right so you don't want that so you want a gradual let's go left you want a gradual left and while this is going gradually left you want to gradually take the left stick right the left stick and go right so it's an opposite movement right so you're kind of twerking the drone and kind of pinch with your fingers so it goes really slow because you don't want fast movements you want nice slow buttery movements there you go look at that beautiful right you can increase the speed but you must increase the speed of both the turn 
and the and the side so if you're going to go further on the on the stick on the left you have to go further on the stick if you're going to push the right stick more to the left you have to push the left stick more to the right and kind of find a balance where it's just nicely smoothly going around and always keep the cross on the option to keep your cross on because it tells you if you're losing your point of interest to the center so right now my point of interest is not in the center so i back off the left stick or i can push the right stick some more either one to compensate and help balance things up so you want to pay attention to your screen all the time and try to keep that cross dead on dead on in the center i know it's going to be hard but you gotta try here we go let's wrap guys wrap wrap and you just gotta hold it there like hold it once you find that sweet spot just hold it 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 try to hold it in the center now it's hard for me to do this because i'm see my position right now as i'm looking at you and trying to look at the screen and do this at the same time it's not easy but practice makes perfect guys practice makes perfect try to keep that cross dead center it's not hard guys it's not hard at all look i can do it i can do it i can do it and once you find that sweet spot you hold the sticks right there the drone will consistently wrap around <music> Always look and make sure that at the height that you're going to orbit, everything around you, except your point of interest, is clear. Be conscious while you're putting the sticks right and left, or it's the opposite to go the other way. It would be right and left, depending on which way you want to go. While you're executing this maneuver, remember that you don't ever want to push forward on the sticks. Keep right as a clean right. Don't end up going right and forward because you'll end up going into your point of interest. Don't end up going right and backwards because you'll start pulling away from your point of interest. And if you're doing your point of interest and you end up going up or down, that's another problem. You'll go above your point of interest or you'll start going down and be careful going down because you didn't cater the lower you go. There might be buildings and stuff around you. So once you take these things into consideration, you should be spot on and last but not least go in cine smooth mode because all the sticks become slower and easier to respond to and that will give you nice slow controlled movements that makes it easier for you to learn with and then you can always go to p mode once you feel comfortable and you've perfected your craft there you have it as you can see the automatic smart shot feature which does the circle is not ideal for orbiting and results might vary depending on location interference and what you're um, drawing that box around what your point of interest is and how good the software on the drone is able to lock onto it and keep onto it it's always best that you remember how to do things manually I smash that like button let it turn blue big thumbs up if you got value from this video make sure you hit subscribe if you're new here hit the bell icon as well so you can get notified when i release more dji mavic mini videos with that being said guys i've got to run i will see you guys whenever i can Big shout out to Autonomous Drone Services and MadMixTube.com for providing us with the equipment to make these videos possible. I'm still giving away six DJI Mavic 2 Pros or Zooms. Head over to my Patreon account, donate a dollar, become a patron, and automatically you're entered to win a chance to win one of six of those drones. Guys, let's make this happen. Come on, support me and help me support you.